up everyone, welcome back to Inside Gyros. Um, today we have the scenario based training simulation with a special guest. Um, I will explain on the ground all the maneuvers, so take the maneuvers on the ground and they will come back here on the cockpit. I will not be flying today, so this is a very easy flight for me. I will be the navigator, I will be do all the parameters here. So check right now the, the the explanation on the ground and we'll be back. Alright, so we're gonna describe in the ground the um, the exercise for today is a ground reference exercise using the scenario base. So the idea today is take some photograph and do some later scanning on some areas. So we're gonna use ground reference maneuvers with time. So starting here, the best, the, the best way to start is in the ground. So your, your visual point is more or less the same distance through the ground that when you're flying. So this point is flying, right? So we have our ground reference and, uh, and we have our, our routine. So we start the routine, we know that the north will be in the back, we are heading south, and when we start the routine, the first exercise is a square. All right, so welcome back again. We're ready to start. We're gonna be full concentration here. We're gonna do the maneuvers. So stand by for starting. We check numbers here. With the altitude and the speed. The speed will be between 40 and 50, all right? Stand by for exercise number one. It will be square left. Confirm. All right. Ten seconds. Five. One. Mark. This is the level you get 17 hours, so you have to keep up, guys. Actually, after yesterday, it was closer to 20. We flew a lot yesterday. 20? Yeah. Yeah. So, okay, this is 20 hours, guys. So, keep up. This is really good. Okay. The speed have to be controlled, otherwise the, the square will be not paint completely, all right? All right. There your area. Seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Mark. A little bit out, because if we go in, the wind will take us into the to the circuit. So to avoid that, we need to be a little bit out, a little bit out, just with the 45 on the central point, and we come back to the center where we initiate the maneuver. As soon as we come back here, that should take us uh, less than, uh, if it's standard, it will be two minutes. We're going to do it in one minute. And then we come back here, we do the same. The wind's coming from the north. So we need to aim more or less to the north, like this. 
keep the turning, keep the turning, keeping the distance, and using ground reference in the coordinates, in four coordinates on the turn, right? Actually, the fact that girls are multitask, they can have, they have, they, they think in stereo. They can get a lot of information around that make it be better pilots than men. We men, we need to start train our brain to think in stereo because we are mono. If we go one thing, we only can do one thing. That's the difference. So this is what girls are faster learning than us. I mean, it, to do this, it took me like, I don't know, 150 hours to make it barely like she did it. All right, Mark, congratulations. This is a small example. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for letting us participate today in this. Um, use your uh, ground reference maneuvers so you can uh, make some time, waypoints, you have fun in the air, and you actually pushing yourself to be more precise. The GPS track, it will tell you if you painted the same or not. You can, dif you can paint different maneuvers on the ground. So thanks for watching, guys. This is uh, a scenario-based training, one-to-one, -one, more or less, for later scanning and photography, right? That is more or less what we're looking for. If, uh, if you need drone scanning or uh, photographs from the air, all the information will be in the links where you subscribe. Um, see you guys around. Bye.